Hey friends, so it's like 1 o'clock in the morning and I'm up editing a video, but as you can see, I'm going to show you in this video how to do a quick weave, um, Betty on a Budget, got this hair from the Beauty Supply Store, so stay tuned if um, you want to know how to do a quick weave with a leap out, yes, and I left my edges out also, so stay tuned, I'll show you in this video. Hi, okay, so um, I'm just taking my hair to the ponytail right now, scratching my head because Lord, it be itching. Um, so as you can see, I am gonna comb well, detangle my hair out because I'm going to braid it. So <laughs> I don't know what I did. But as you can see, I'm detangling my hair. Um, I don't know what I had in my hair before. I think I had probably a wig on before I did me a quick weave. So um, that's what I'm doing at the current moment. This is some protective shield I bought that I didn't even use. I did not even use that. I just saw it on videos and TikTok, but I did not use that. I used the wig cap, and this is the hair that I got, Organique, um, 24 inches. They have 30 inches, but I got 24 because I'm very short. I got me some bonding glue and some new scissors for um, cutting purposes because, yeah, I needed some. So right now, I'm just going to section my hair off. Um... I'm doing me a middle part. So, as you can see, I'm trying to get my middle part. I'm concentrating. I'm trying to get my middle part in the middle. I didn't want no middle. <laughs> so, I'm getting my middle part in the middle. And then I'm going to section my leave out. Um, As you can see right now. So, I use the two-finger method. So, I put two fingers on my head. And then I will section my leave out and go around in like a little U-shape. So I make sure that my tracks are covered. Right here, I'm sectioning out the edges that I want to be left out because, yeah, I very much care about my edges. Wigs, wigs don't really be on my edges like that, but still, I care about my edges. So, I'm sectioning my edges out, and I'm just going to braid it out the way so it can not be, not be, so it cannot have glue on it, and I'm going to take it down later, as you can see, and flatten it, but... My hair, I'm just sectioning off my edges, sectioning off my hair, so I'll let y'all watch me do that before I put the cap on. So as you can see, I'm sectioning off my hair to start braiding it. Um... I braid my hair depending on if I'm doing a quick weave, a sew-in. But for this video, I'm doing a quick weave, so I braid all my hair down to the back. Um, if I was doing the side part, I would do the same thing, braid all my hair down to the back. Especially since I'm having a leave out and I want it to be flat at the top, I braid all my hair down. Um, this is the oil I had bought from a local person here in Chattanooga where I stay so I'm just gonna oil my scalp because I want my hair to grow and be have nutrients while it's up under this scalp 
because my head will itch and I will pull it off so fast. Don't ask me, but I will pull it off so fast. So that's currently what I'm doing. Now that I don't oil my scalp, um, I'm putting the cap on, so I'm looking in the mirror, <laughs> trying to see where um I should put the concealer. So this is how I do mine. I take some concealer. I took the lightest one I had, um, and then I squeeze it out. So you can get this from also the beauty supply store. The concealer, um. I am making a outline of where it needs to be cut at um, and where the hair should not be glued at. So that's currently what I'm doing at the moment um, to put the concealer on there make sure I'm putting it in the right spot so where I don't glue no hair down. And then I'm going to put on another cap to make sure that my hair is protected from the glue. And I'm not going to lie, y'all. It did protect my hair from the glue so well like i had just snatched it off <laughs> when i was done and it was no glue on my hair so right here that's why i'm saying i didn't use the protective shield stuff i used gots to be which is also from the beauty supply store but i always have gots to be because i wear wigs um and you see me trying to look at the shield stuff because i was like do i want to put that on my head it, no, I didn't. I didn't feel like it. So, I used the Goss to be, and I sprayed it on there probably about twice, and I, um, I lost my train of thought. I sprayed it on there twice, and then I blow dried it a little bit to make sure that it stays. So now it's time to get into the hair, okay? So I start taking the hair out. I'm showing y'all the hair. The hair is really good, y'all. Like, you can't, it's not like a human hair. It's like a human hair slash synthetic mix. But as you can see, after I had put the second cap on, I had outlined it again with a brighter concealer because I had put on the second cap, so I couldn't see the concealer that was up under. But as you can see, so I would take the track, measure it to where I wanted it to be, and then put glue on it and just stick it to my head. So I repeat that process until I get to the top of my head. I do mine in like a U-shape, so even if I was doing a side part, I would still do it in a U-shape. And it was kind of hard due to the fact that I didn't have like, a back mirror. I'm so used to being at my mama's house and having a back mirror to see in the back of my head. Um, that it was kind of hard. I just had to use my fingers to guide and also not put tracks like right on top of each other. But I did a very good job, as you can see from the beginning of the video. Um, I'm actually thinking about doing me another quick weave right now because <laughs> my son's birthday is about to come up and I have my tape ends that I really tried to turn into clip-ins but that did not work so i'm trying to figure out something else to do with them and i still want to do them in a quick weave um middle part still or it might even be a side part no really middle part but anyway so that's what i did y'all i just measured i measured every piece to where i was going to lay it down at um and then as you can see i was i started feeling myself but i put glue on it put in a U shape and I did that all the way to the top of my head.
so once I got to the top of my head, um, as you see, I brushed the hair out, um, made sure that it was straight, made sure that it was going to be good, and yeah, so that's just me cleaning up cleaning the brush out so as you can see the hair is very natural looking it's so silky when you first put it in it does of course get a little tangled on um, what you wear for a couple days but all you have to do is comb it out or flatter in it or put some bio silk in it or you know what you have to do to a natural weave so right here i'm about to cut the excess cap off so that is just me showing y'all back of course i have to show y'all but um i'm right here i'm about to cut the excess cap off of it and i had to make sure i did not cut my hair y'all because i'm i'm good about um cutting my hair baby <laughs> i would cut my hair and not even know y'all but as you see, I'm cutting out the part where my leave out was. So I glued the hair up until it touched that concealer line. And then I also had put a concealer line on the sides, also where my leave out was. So, well, yeah, where my edges was. So as you can see, I am making sure I do not cut my hair and trying to cut all of that cap off. So I cut that side. So I'm just going to do the same to the other side. And then I'm gonna flat iron, so Another nice tip um, to make it go faster is also plug your flutterings up when you almost at the top of your head. Because as you can see, once I undid my baby hairs, I was ready to flat iron my weave. So as you can see, it's blending really, really nice. So just wait till I flat iron my real hair, y'all. And I do dye my real hair jet black because I love black hair. So I think I got this in a, I think I got this hair in a one and it was no more than $25. I really want to say it was no more than $25. I took some bio silk and I'm finna pour my hair back down the middle and I'm putting some bio silk on my hair to make sure that it gets straight, silky straight and I'm pouring my hair down the middle so um, I can flat iron it. And y'all gonna see how it come out, baby. Cause I didn't come to play when it came to this quick weave. see it blends so well with my real hair right here i'm about to cut it because you know how you have like people be like you be having a short leave out but then you have long hair so this just helps it blend better with the hair um cut it in down part and then i'll put my westing on there to make sure it's laying flat i didn't plug my high combs up because i didn't want to but um as you can see it blended very nice i hope you all enjoyed this video 
and stay tuned for more videos see y'all my next one bye